Jack Nolan here at the Goog with Julian Aquar. Just uh, two more Saturdays to go, that final Saturday, the Blue Goal game. How is this defensive line coming along, especially your position, the defensive end? Uh, the defensive ends are doing great. I definitely think we're we're out there doing our job. We're being becoming the best D lines in the country, working hard, working to improve from what we did last year. I mean, whatever happened last year is gone. We don't have the same guys as a new team. So I definitely think we got we need guys to step up and be be more of a be more of a factor in their game. And I think we're all improving. I think we're all doing a great job of going in there and knowing our what we need to do and just honing on on the right technique and what we need to do be the best on it, obviously. And you've got new guys, but certainly I call them the big three at defensive end. You, Khalid, Dalen, you're all back. You had such great success last year. What do you guys believe you need to improve on this year? Uh, last year we felt like we came up short from our goals. Um, coming into the spring, we definitely took an emphasis of being on the best D-line in the country and being able to emphasize that every day, trying to get the, the younger guys who don't have that much experience to go out there and do their job and knowing we can count on them for any, any task we call upon them for, for them to do. Um, being, being, playing for those D lines, obviously one of the best things that ever happened to me. Um, playing with these guys, and my brother saw so do anything, do everything to uh, sell my, go out there and make plays for them. You made life very unpleasant for opposing quarterbacks last year, but I know the sack numbers weren't where you wanted them to be. You still had an impact. Do you expect the sack numbers to go up? Oh, I definitely do. I definitely. Um, one of my one of my huge things that bothered me last year would be not being able to finish on sacks. Um, I definitely want to improve on that. Uh, there's definitely a lot of times where I'm ran by the quarterback, and I want to stop that and being able to level rush and being able to get on the quarterback every chance I get, and not letting those little when quarterback makes a little move and I shake and I shake off and fall off, fall down. I think uh, one of the things I'm working on being able to finish on the quarterback, take him down when I need to, make plays in the right time, and being being the best de defensive end in the country. A couple of mainstays who played inside on the defensive line last year have moved on. As you look at the guys stepping up inside, how do they look right now? Oh, they look great. They're all, all, all the guys, the younger guys, they're all de definitely taking the, t uh, taking the coaching and they're translating into the field. Which is, they're doing a great job of being able to step in and make plays. Kurt, Myron, Jason, they're all doing, they're doing, doing a great job. Lace, even the new early enrollees, they've been doing a great job. Uh, they listen to older guys. The older guys are coaching them. The coaches are coaching them. They're taking it on. And they're having pride and having fun doing it. So. How much do you think the depth helped this line last year that you were able to rotate guys in continually throughout the game? Yeah, it was nice. Um, there were definitely times where the, fir the first string guys were getting tired and being able to just rotate a whole line, have guys who were fresh and knew what they were doing and being able to step in and make plays, it was, it was, it was definitely a great thing to have. It, um, we de never took it for granted. Um, they, it was nice to have guys who could step in, make plays, and be a factor in the game and still, have, still be a problem for the quarterback and the O-lines whenever when they were called upon. Does it look like to you have that same depth this year? Uh, we definitely do. I th we have more guys coming in the summer. We have a lot of guys for D tackles and the noses and the ends. So I think we're pretty solid on the on the depth. We've been able to do the same thing this year. All right, basically two weeks left, spring practice. What do you need to get done? Uh, just finishing it out the right way, knowing knowing we have a uh, task and something we need, a goal we need to reach and be able to prepare to win a national championship for this team next year. All right, Junior, thank you very much. Thank you. With Junior Aquara, I'm Jack Nolan, Fighting Irish Media.